I'm Dean Martin and I farm in the Harrow area and our farm is called Harrow Organic Farms. We are certified organic. And I farmed conventionally for 20 years and then I was looking for something to be able to diversify into, something to make room for my kids to be able to farm. So I looked into organic farming and began to transition in the early 2000s. We're now almost 20 years into it and we've doubled the size of our farm. Cover crop is any crop that you plant that isn't going to be harvested. It's planted for the aspects of being beneficial to the ground or beneficial to the next crop or the crop that you're in. We grow cover crops because it's an easy way to produce nitrogen or organic matter that goes into the soil and gives us good soil health. It also helps with the infiltration of water. If you have good cover crops with a good root system, water on a heavy rain will just permeate into the soil. It's also very good to hold on to nutrients so they won't get washed away and go into our water systems. Cover crop also affects weed management. You can have a nice crop of cover crop which will smother out weeds and reduce the number of weed seeds that they produce. From a financial aspect, cover crops replace commercial fertilizers. For people starting out in cover cropping, my biggest suggestion is to keep it simple. There's a lot of research about multiple species. My belief is to decide what you want from the cover crop, whether you want nitrogen, whether you want carbon, whether you want to concentrate on soil health, and really pick a cover crop that does what you want. There isn't anything or any mixture that will give you all things. Everything's always a trade-off. And so when you're starting out, just pick something simple, pick one or two species of cover crop and try to concentrate on that. The maintaining of the soil and soil regeneration is extremely important to me personally. I'm a third generation, my sons are farming with me. Maintaining the health of that soil is not just for me, but it's for the generations that follow me. This is a legacy that's been handed to me and I want to hand off.